character I play is called Seafoot. He's a city trader uh, who has no moral scruples whatsoever and is a complete cocaine addict. So um, that's why I employ Michael Bryce, who's played by Ryan Reynolds, to get me out of my office building in the first film and out of a nightclub where I'm completely exploding with cocaine in the second film. In this sequel to Hitman's Bodyguard, I, my character Seifert is found in a dodgy nightclub in Italy and surrounded by people a third of his age drinking too much and taking too many drugs and he is turfed out. Playing anybody who is in a state of extremis, as this character is, hyper-energized, hyper-drugged, hyper-drunk, is means that you get to do on screen what you never do in real life, um, as I'm allergic to alcohol. So uh, it's, it's good fun to do, because it's something that, you know, it's the whole point of being an actor, that you get to play and do stuff that you would never do in you know, your ordinary life. Patrick Hughes, a director, is a combination of, who shall I say, Martin Scorsese meets Quentin Tarantino meets Jerry Lewis. He's hilarious and he's Australian, so he's got a completely, um, there, there's, no, there's no airs and graces about him. He's not, he takes the work seriously, but with the best lesser fair attitude that you could hope for. So he's, he's out to have a good time and that's, you know, hopefully what transmits in the finished product to what people see.